tonight I want to try to show you how to adjust a starter. I don't know if you remember here that night when I was trying to start this car, the starter was sounded a little bit noisy to me and a lot of times that means it's out of adjustment. The way to get them adjusted is you take a 1 8 inch rod or a shaft and in this case I'm using a drill bit and you should be able to slide that in between the shaft on the starter and the flywheel like so. Now the only reason why I'm able to slide that in there right now at this time is because as you can see the starter is the bolts are loose on it. Whenever I tighten this starter up snug up against the block this 1 8 inch drill bit will not be able to slide between the teeth on this flywheel and the shaft on the starter. So what you do in a case like that is you can use shims to get that starter a little bit further away from the engine block. You can take one bolt out and you can take this shim and hopefully slide it in there. What do you know? I got it in there. I went down to the auto parts store and bought a package of these shims for four bucks. I put the thickest one in first just to see. Be great if this one does it. This is kind of hard to film. It's kind of supposed to fit snug. Doesn't seem to fit very snug. I may need to use a thinner shim. Let me try to snug the tighten the starter up a little bit more and we'll see. <clears throat> yeah, that did it. If I had my wires hooked up. I would check to see if how it sounds. You know, whenever you hit a starter and it it grinds and makes a lot of noise, it's because the starter's not properly shimmed. Well, this is the way you get the proper adjustment on that. Maybe a little later, I can try to start it up and see what we have. <clears throat> 